استقبل حضرة صاحب الجلالة الملك حمد بن عيسى الخليفة ملك البلاد المفدى حفظه الله ورعاه في قصر الصخير يوم أمس كبار المشاركين في مؤتمر حوار المنامة في دورته السابعة عشرة والذي ينظمه سنويا المعهد الدولي للدراسات الاستراتيجية بالتعاون مع وزارة الخارجية نعم في بداية الاستقبال رحب جلالته بضيوف البلاد في مملكة البحرين ومشاركتهم في مؤتمر حوار المنامة
ثم تفضل حضرة صاحب الجلالة بإلقاء كلمة سامية بهذه المناسبة Ladies and gentlemen, His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, the King of the Kingdom of Bahrain. Salam alaikum. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Salam alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. It is my great pleasure to warmly welcome so many distinguished participants to the 17th WIWS Manama Dialogue. I hope that your time in the Kingdom of Bahrain will be both enjoyable and constructive. Over the past two years, our world has passed through the worst health crisis in modern history, which has challenged every single country, regardless of size, wealth, or resources. Yet, we in the Kingdom of Bahrain are proud that we have been able to overcome even the most difficult periods of the pandemic. Thanks to the work of our National Medical Task Force, led by His Royal Highness, the Crown Prince and Prime Minister. This comprehensive and multi-agency response has been highly successful in combating all aspects of the pandemic. We have been pleased to receive international praise and recognition for our response, but this serves simply to reinforce our wish to share our experience with others. In return, we welcome the chance to exchange expertise and experience with friends across the world. As you will all recognize, the Middle East is a region of critical importance for the entire world, but a region whose security and stability remain subject to many challenges. We in Bahrain are convinced that security and stability leading to peace is best built on preserving the best aspects of what defines us and maintaining rights as the foundation of progress and development and for trade. At the same time, it is essential regional maritime security is safeguarded against any hostile acts and to protect freedom of navigation and the commercial sea routes which serve the entire world economy. In the Kingdom of Bahrain, we have always been and remain committed to peace, dialogue, coexistence, as underlined most recently by the Abraham Accords. These historic agreements reaffirm our principled and courageous approach to achieving peace as the ultimate prize for our region and all its people. In the Arabian Gulf, the GCC remains a cornerstone of stability and its unity is a source of strength and good for all stakeholders, both in the region and beyond. To maintain this unity, Bahrain is committed to open channels of communication to address any outstanding issues. As an example, of how such matters can be resolved between brotherly and friendly states. Against this background, the Kingdom of Bahrain greatly appreciates the role of the IISS Manama Dialogue as the principal regional forum for the exchange of views and insights to protect and enhance regional security. We highly value the outstanding efforts of the IISS in organizing the dialogue and appreciate the attendance of so many distinguished participants. So welcome once again to the Kingdom of Bahrain. We wish all of you every success 
and the 2021 Manama Dialogue and offer our best wishes to you for 2022. Thank you. هذا وقد قام جلالة الملك المفدى مادوبة عشاء تكريما لكبار المشاركين في حوار المنامة حيث تبادل جلالته مع الحضور الأحاديث حول أهمية انعقاد حوار المنامة وأبرز القضايا التي يناقشها في جلساته والتي تعكس القناعة بأن الحوار المشترك هو الوسيلة الأنجح للحفاظ على أمن واستقرار المنطقة